Welcome back to my channel, it's Tash Anasiri and this is another week in my life as a nursing student. On Monday, I got to work from home, so I went to a cafe with Patrick to get some studying done. This cafe was actually super cute. It had like books for sale and coffee items for sale and whatever. So I, we just ended up sitting by the window and enjoying our coffee. Patrick read from his Kobo while I did some assignments that had to be done. When we came home, I got to play with Jasper for a bit. He was being so adorable. I love when he sleeps like that with his paws, like, turned down. I think it's so cute. And then for dinner, we had some vegetarian penne pasta that I made. I just used like nutritional yeast and spinach, some milk, some cheese, and broccoli and onions. On Tuesday, I started my day off at the gym, just got a little run in on the treadmill, and then I took the transit system to my practicum in the community, as you guys know. It was a lot of paperwork today and a lot of meetings and phone calls. We also got to start our teaching plan. My peer and I are going to be doing a presentation for grade school children about diabetes, so that will be super fun. Later on in the day, I got to visit an elementary school and a shadow one of the nurses give faculty teaching about a kid's diabetes that attended that school. In the evening, I went to a cafe just to get an assignment done. Sometimes it's really hard for me to get it done at home, so it was very helpful. Patrick made burgers for dinner, which was so yummy and so nice of him. I love them. The veggie burgers are so good. I just got some work done while he did that. On Wednesday, I had a doctor's appointment. It was nice catching up with my family physician. And then afterwards for lunch, Patrick and I had sandwiches that had tomato and cheese and onion in it on some really yummy bread. Afterwards, we went on a nice walk to a local cafe again. I like switching up my cafes. I think it's really fun to go to a different one every time. So this one was also very nice. It had green and plants everywhere. The only thing was that it was kind of cold and I got an ice drink, so that was my bad, but we still had a really good time. I got a lot of stuff done. I think I had a paper due that I got to finish and that was me just reading some peer-reviewed articles that I was referencing in my paper. For dinner, Patrick and I had a tomato-based pasta with some spinach, veggies, and mushrooms, as well as some green olive loaf on the side. Thursday, I started my day off doing some work and studying. Is it safe to speak? Are we all alone? Afterwards, I headed off to class. I have two classes on Thursdays. We just had lecture and learned some important nursing information as usual. In the evening, I just had an English muffin and a yogurt bowl with strawberries for dinner and had some tea and read my book. On Friday, we had a nice walk in the morning, Patrick and I, and we got to just chat and catch up and de-stress because this week has been really hectic for me. But what happens here? Won't stay between us. In the evening, we took a spontaneous trip to Ikea, which was really random, but we needed to get some stuff for the house. So we just thought we'd go to Ikea. We ended up eating dinner at Ikea, which consisted a lot of fries and like these veggie scallion things. Hey guys, I'm taking a study break and I got a package in the mail. It's um, the Always Pan from our place. I thought I would unbox it with you guys just for fun. I'll let you guys know what my first thoughts are. 
So this is how big the box is. Sorry if you guys can hear the dishwasher, it's running. I just decided to do the dishes before filming. I'm gonna start over here. Stay between us. That's nice. It has welcome to our place. We saved you a seat. And then it says what they believe in and why they made it. It comes with um like a sponge and a little handout that just says what you can use it for and more of their branding. A nice little paper clip. I ended up um, getting the pink color, which is really pretty. It's nice. So that's the arrow that shows where to close the lid for the spatula to line up, which is nice. It's nice and light too. We recently bought like plates and bowls from the same company and we really liked them. So we decided to get the pan as well. This is what it looks like. It's a pretty good size. It's a really good size. I guess I'll save that for later. It says nesting steamer basket for dumplings, veggies, and more. That's really cute. And then it has the metal basket that has two handles for steaming. That's nice. And then here it says, the always pan is designed to help you do more with less. So get ready to steam, saute, braise, fry, stew, boil, sear, serve, store, and more. They have really nice packaging. I'm not gonna lie. And then, the inside looks good. There's a little bit of pink paint on the edges here, but it just comes off, so that's fine. It's light, but it's heavier than I thought it would be. Feels nice. I like how they added this part so the bottom won't get ruined as easily. Yeah, it, looks, it feels really well made. I mean, there's a lot of reviews out there if you guys wanna see or watch other people's, but it's very aesthetically pleasing. I'm really excited to use it. This is the spatula in the box. It says for anything you nudge, flip, fry, or stir. And then it talks about how the, the spatula bag is compostable and biodegradable, which is really nice. Love to see that in a company. And I like that this is wood. Apparently you're not supposed to use any metal in the pan because it will scratch. So it's nice that the spatula is wood. And then it just rests here, like that. And then you can close it. It's really nice. I'm excited, you guys. It's pretty. I feel like it really looks good in the kitchen. It's going to replace a lot of pots and pans that we don't need as well. It'll save space and I won't feel like I have to put it away or anything, which is also really nice. And then at dinner time, we had a pizza that we made. It had just a lot of veggies, tomato sauce, mushrooms, broccoli, onion. It was so good. I loved it. Trust, but what happens here?